on a Friday night yet Start from the top, shall we? My name is Stephanie Crawford. Don't laugh at my last name. I know it's goofy. I'm 20 years old and life has been rough to say the least. I don't have any friends and everyone thinks I'm weird, <laughs> but I try. All my life I've been a social outcast and I want to make myself a better person. And what better way to get out there than meeting someone super famous, right? So, last night, I'm watching Keeping Up With The Dearest, and I got pretty bored of watching their lavish life. So I decided to flip through some channels and found myself watching the local news. There was this boy going up against this midget ginger kid with a gun, dodging bullets and rapping all at the same time. He was so brave. I couldn't stop gushing over just how cool and dreamy this guy was. I just needed to meet him by any means necessary. I found the ginger boy dealing drugs in the same area as the news. I asked him if he knew where the blue haired boy was, but he said he didn't know anything. So I used a little bit of my persuasive skills and he pointed me in the right direction. <laughs> that blue haired boy was within my grasp. It was like he was right here. Yet so far. Damn! Oh, sorry. I'm too excited explaining this stuff. <laughs> Anyways, I was told to meet this mill named Mommy Mirrors in a victorious truth. 
this woman had like three bags in her hand, but I quickly interrupted her shopping. Hello, miss. Are you Mommy Maris? Who did that? She gave me this weird look, but then we started talking. I quickly explained to her that I was after this boy in particular, and her face lit up with excitement. She crouched down next to me and started telling me about her plans to take him down. Ugh, I didn't want that. I told her I just wanted him to myself. She took a moment to think, but she offered me a deal. I'll tell you where he is if you accept these special hypnotizing powers. And then you can have him all to yourself. I was like, you have to tell me twice, hooray! So I got the powers and his location. This was the best day ever. Miss Milfy told me that he'll be signing shirts and selling his mixtape at a meet and greet in Times Square. With his girlfriend? Yuck. I'll happily take her damn place, that's for sure. So I met up with him and this is where our story begins. <laughs>
two, one.
two, one. to freestyle funkin get your head in the game it's time to begin 